Tonight, the Justice Department charging three men it calls Iranian government hackers with a plot to stoke discord and erode confidence ahead of the U.S. election. The 37-page indictment describing a wide-ranging hacking campaign, alleging the men targeted Trump campaign officials' emails, stealing internal documents, including debate prep, and shopping them to the news media and the Biden-Harris campaign. The defendants' own words make clear that they were attempting to undermine former President Trump's campaign in advance of the 2024 U.S. presidential election. The alleged hackers facing terrorism, fraud, and identity theft charges. They worked for Iran's Revolutionary Guard Corps, according to the indictment. All three live in Iran, likely outside the reach of U.S. law enforcement. The Iranian government has denied involvement. U.S. officials are battling propaganda and disinformation efforts, not just out of Iran, but also Russia and China. Microsoft saying this staged video of men beating up a woman in a Trump shirt was cooked up by a Russian troll farm to discredit Kamala Harris. Matthew oh, yeah, Olson is the DOJ's to top away. national security official. Is it true? There's no question that our adversaries, Iran and Russia, China, they view our election as a moment of vulnerability for us. And that's only going to increase as election day approaches. Garland said there's no evidence anyone on the Biden and Harris campaigns replied to the emails offering them stolen Trump documents. Lester? Thanks for watching. Stay updated about breaking news and top stories on the NBC News app or follow us on social media.